So they prayed to Krishna that we are suffering, kidnapped by this rascal. Please save us. Uh, so Krishna came to rescue them, and uh, the Bhavasura was killed, and all the girls were made free. But after freedom, they were still standing there. So Krishna asked them, now you can go home to your father. And they said that we are kidnapped and we cannot be married. Uh, in India still that rule is there. If one girl, young girl, goes out of home for one day or two days, nobody will marry him. Nobody will marry him is considered to be spoiled. This is still the Indian system. So they were kidnapped so many days or so many years. So they appealed to Krishna that will not be accepted either by our father, neither anybody will agree to marry. Then Krishna understood that their vision is very precarious. Although they are released, they cannot go anywhere. Then Krishna, uh, is so kind, bhakta bhakta he inquired, what do you want? That they said that you accept me, otherwise we have no other means to stay. Uh, Krishna immediately said, yes, come on. <laughs> this is Krishna. And not that he, sixteen thousand wives, was concentrated in one camp. He immediately constructed sixteen thousand palaces. Because he has accepted as wife, he must be maintained as his wife, as his queen. Not that because they had no other means, they have come to my shelter, I can keep them anyway. No. Most respectfully. Uh, as queen, as Krishna's queen. And again he thought that the sixteen thousand wives, so if I remain alone, one figure, then my wives cannot meet me. Everyone has to wait for sixteen thousand days to see the husband. No. He expanded himself into sixteen thousand Krishna. This is Krishna. The Daskal, they uh, accuse Krishna as Oman hunter. It is not like you. You cannot maintain even one wife. But he maintained sixteen thousand wives in sixteen thousand palaces and in sixteen thousand expansion of all. Everyone was pleased. This is Krishna. Uh, we have to understand what is Krishna. Don't try to imitate Krishna. First of all, uh, try to understand Krishna. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna. 